In this video, I will show you how to fix Grub and OS Prober not detecting Windows on EFI systems. Before we begin, make sure you hit subscribe and tap the bell icon to get daily tech videos. After dual booting Windows and Linux on an EFI system a very common error that people face is that the Grub menu doesn't show Windows boot entry. Even though Windows is there but no option to boot and here I will show you how to fix that. Basically you have to manually create the Windows boot entry. So, boot into the Linux system and open the terminal. The first step to identify the BIOS boot partition. Run this command and then see the partition name and number corresponding to the BIOS boot label. In this case, it is dev slash sda1. But it can be sda2 or some other name. Remember the partition name as we need its UUID. To get the UUID, run this command with the correct partition name and then copy the UUID from it without the quotes and save it somewhere. Now, we need to create a custom grub entry. Run this command with nano to open this grub configuration file. Paste this code that you can get from the description of this video. In this code, you just need to change the name of Windows boot entry and replace the UUID underscore here variable with the actual UUID of the partition that we copied in the earlier step. Save the changes by pressing Ctrl plus O exit by pressing Ctrl plus X. Run the update grub command then you are done. Reboot your PC now and you will see the new Windows boot entry. Select this and then Windows will boot normally now. So this way you can now add a manual Windows boot entry on Grub menu if it fails to detect Windows automatically. Feel free to watch other videos on our channel and don't hesitate to leave your comments and questions.